This is EasyOSX, and in this quick video, I'm showing you how to customize your cursor in macOS. If you're looking to add a little of your own personality to your Mac, or you want to improve your cursor's visibility, here's a quick guide on how to do so. This will be for macOS 13, Ventura, or later. Open the Settings app and scroll down the left sidebar until you see Accessibility. Click on that, then click on Display on the right-hand side of the app. Now scroll down to the Pointer section and you'll see Pointer Size, Pointer Outline Color, currently set to white, and pointer fill color, currently set to black. Pointer size is useful if you have trouble seeing the mouse either due to vision troubles or having a very large monitor. Dragging the slider across the bar will adjust the size of the mouse in real time. Let's move down to pointer colors. Clicking on one of these colors will bring up the color picker window in a new smaller window, and from there you can select your color from the color wheel or click one of the other headers in the picker window to change the color with sliders, existing color palettes, etc. Once you've picked the color, you can see how your change looks by slowly moving the cursor outside the window into the desktop or another window. You can then make changes or close that window and change the other color item. You may notice the cursor changes back to its default color a couple of times while it's moving around. That's because the change won't be fully set until the settings app has been closed. And at that point, it will apply everywhere. If you ever decide to change it, you can go back to that same area and pick new colors or hit the reset colors button to return the cursor to its default black and white. Thank you all so much for watching. If this video helped you out, then give it a like. It'll really help the channel. Likewise, if you want more Mac, iOS, and other Apple tips, tricks, and advice, you can subscribe to the channel. You can also check out the website, easyosx.net, as well as our social media pages. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time.